you put it out. All right. All right, thank you. All right, the next speaker is uh, Bray Liston. Who now? This is uh, Bray. Bray Liston. Right. I've lost my sheets. I don't have any of these sheets. Wait a minute. I've lost them. Unless I'm... Unless that was, uh, oh. that's your name? Are you okay. Bray Liston? I'm Bray Liston. Okay. Hello, sir. Hello. Hello. Good evening. Thank you, Mr. President, Superintendent, and Board Members. I'm here tonight as a supporting parent, a parent of three. I'm Brad's dad. Oh. Oh. Oh, okay. I raised three children of my own. I have ten grandchildren, eight of whom are or have recently been students in the Canals County Schools, all of which have received academic recognition as well as character recognition in their classrooms. And I'm very proud of that and appreciative of it. But <clears throat> as their grandfather, I'm very distraught and disappointed Teacher. at the kind of material that they have been exposed to and are expected to be exposed to in their classrooms. It distresses me no end to think and have to believe that the, those people in our school system, and more specifically, those who choose the classroom materials with our, which our young people and children are taught, have to stoop so low to use this type of pornographic material that Brad was reading you just a bare touch of in their classrooms to teach literature to our young people and children. I'm pleased that Mr. Leone and the board thought this was too graphic and so forth to appear in this meeting and to, above all to be heard on public television. And I hope everybody will take note of that because the policy of the school board should be not to approve this kind of pornographic stuff but to keep it out of the school system completely. And I thank you for your time. All right, Can thank you, you come back on the 11th please? Yeah, you sound good. We'll be here. All right. 